Hello, good morning and welcome. My name is John Barley and I'm your sales advisor here in Farming Simulator 19. Our today's topic is cultivators or cultivators and discarrows to be precise. Um, to start it off, wow, I just can say, wow, how many equipment do we actually have in this game um, with regards to these types of equipment? And I'm only covering um, the official in-game equipment here and the official by Giants uh, released items and seeing them all standing here um, apart from having just looking at them in the in the menu it's amazing how big the variety of this equipment is and it, um, actually if you and considering the fact that you can also have mods which are not um, uh, which are not officially from giants so independent mods also where, where you can have cultivators um, or disc harrows it's amazing how much equipment you actually have and uh, uh, my personal opinion is if you don't find anything that suits you that you like with these equipment you're probably doing something wrong um, well starting it off um, Cultivators and discos. If you're asking yourself, well, what about power power heroes? Um, these will be covered later in a later video um, with regards uh, to cedars. Um, yeah, because they kind of work together. So let's start it off. We will start with these three um, cultivators over here. Um, we have two Stara um, cultivators. And a coon um, disc carol. Um, these are standing a little bit aside um, because they also have the ability to, um, of course, cultivate your fields, but also you can seed um, with these. Um, you can show it here at the coon device. Um, the um, lid is open. If we jump to up the ladder here, there you can see there is seed in it. The same with this Stara or with the Stara here attached to the Lamborghini and you can see it. It's in German, I know, I'm sorry, um, but trust me, this is canola, um, grass or oil, well, oil, 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 ah, I'm missing the word, but you know what I mean. Um, uh, this troubles me, what, what's it called? Um, oil seed radish that's what it's called now I got it back so um, these actually work like any cedars or planters um, you lower them down you switch them on and then you can see the amount of seed is decreasing so actually this piece of equipment is seeding and cultivating at the same time because if you remember this is our field from the last video which we had plowed first and then limed and now we are cultivating and also for these equipment seeding um, yeah these three um, with these three I mean I now just drove off with, with the Stara IS, ISR laser CR DC 13 which has 4.9 meters working with um, and as you saw the 845 liters tank that's this is a this is the of these three it's the one with the best price performance ratio um, but from my point of view only suitable if you have big farms because you cannot fold it so it's always this five meter wide and if you're going on normal roads five meter width it's yeah a little bit wide at least for german roads so yeah um next on stara fox 11 3.7 meters working with and the coon um disco lander xm52 has six meter working with and we will come back to this device later on um for a certain comparison comparison yeah these are the cultivators which also have a seeding function now moving on to pure cultivators actually so items which only cultivate and don't seed anything um we start here with the Rau Polymark 300, 3 meters working with, 7,000 euros to buy. This is the 
cultivator with the best price performance ratio in the game period um, why is that the fact because if you pay the, buy this for 7,000 euros you pay 2,333 euros and 33 cents per meter working with um, compared to another three meter equipment which is um, this Kuhn device over here it's the Kuhn cult timer L300 also three meters working with but it's already 16,000 euros so more than double the price um, of this Rau Gerät, of this Rau um, cultivator but still these five over here have all a very good price performance ratio um, next one is this TT Big this is a disc harrow uh, five meters working with for uh, no it's not five meters it's uh, 3.4 meters for 13,000 euros this has five meters this is the Agromass um, BTC 50H and this has five meters working with for 25,000 euros so you're basically paying 5,000 euros per meter working width and I hate this one this word width it's very hard for me as a German to spell it um, next up uh, the Amazone Kratos 6002-2 um, a disc carrier which can also have a special attachment um, to use it with your slurry tanks and also can bring fertilizer into the ground if you have this uh, attachment but in this setup over here it's only um, for cultivating um, 6 meter 31,000 euros to buy so it's a little bit it's a little bit over 5,160 euros per meter working with and these are the ones with a good price performance ratio next up the first with an average price performance ratio to say is this item over here it's the Quernland um, quality disc farmer 3000 also 3000 meters working with 18,000 euros to buy um, so even 2000 euros more expensive than the Kuhn device but um, this is a disc harrow and this is a just just a cultivator so it's much more um, uh, has much more components to to be built so that's from my point of view justifies the 2000 euros uh, extra cost compared to the to the Kuhn um, yeah to the Kuhn piece of equipment um, next up we will move a little bit over here to um, our color selection of um, of cultivators so we put them here together um, because I just thought well it looks very nice to have these here and just see them unfolding um, because it's uh, really just flip stuff the next one in our list from a price performance ratio is this one it's the Kökerling all rounder 14.5 meters um, so fairly wide just unfold it uh, I like the look of it uh, how this unfolds um, yes 14.5 meter um, for 49,000 euros so a little bit more than 6,400 euros per meter um, next up will be um, two pieces of horse equipment but we will go through these um, all of these to see how they unfold because it simply looks so good and we put them here together to have the different types of uh, color um, around because you have a blue a yellow a black green and red over there and just I just thought it looks nice to have these here and now the um, this one is really cool to look at when it unfolds I really like it um, this by the way is the flexi coil st820 24 meters uh, working width um, so the widest pieces of equipment you can have but as a matter of fact it's also the most expensive with 
168,000 euros um, purchasing price and you need a 500 PS tractor to pull it. It's fairly expensive and you need fairly expensive equipment to move it but has the widest working with and in comparison you pay 7,750 euros per meter working with. You just let it go down here a little bit. Click. Yes, I'm blocking it. And just let it fly. So it's wonderful how wide that is. Um, yeah, here we have this green one is the uh, da, 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 Amazon. Yes, Amazon Genius 8003 2XTX Super. Eight meters working width. Um, this is one of the um, with the poor price performance ratio it has eight meters for 68,000 euros which is 8,500 euros per meter um, if you recall the flexico which just went off over there um, is 7,500 uh, euros per meter working with so in comparison the one which is just working over there a little bit cheaper the yellow one over here is a Betna Swifter SM18000, so 18 meters, 80.2 meters of working with actually for 120,000 euros. Um, of course, many uh, expensive, but this only breaks down to 6,500 euros per meter working with. So, in comparison, an average one, so not too expensive. Um, when you compare it to this one over here, this is a Porsche Cruiser 12 XL. Um, this one is 12 meters in working width, but for 90, uh, 89,000 euros. So this also pays with se almost 7,500 euros per meters working width. Um, so ab in absolute numbers, of course, this is more expensive, but in comparison, it's a little bit cheaper. Yeah, so these two are our color palette over here. Um, moving on, we will move on to the oh, yes, back back to the um, Horsch equipment because Horsch, we just had that Horsch um, Cruiser 12XL. Horsch um, has a very wide variety, so four pieces of Horsch equipment are actually um, placed around here. Um, we have here the Horsch Tiger. 6 DT, 6 meters of working width. Here, this is the Horsch Joker 12 RT. And here we have the Horsch Tiger 10 LT. And as you just might guess, 10 meters of working width, or 10.2 meters, 12 meters of working width, 12.2 actually, and 6 meters of working width. And here we can also very nicely describe the difference in price performance ratio. The Tiger 6 DT, six meters for 39,000 euros. The Horsch Joker 12 RT, 12.2 meters for 80,000 euros. So buying two of these would cost 78,000 euros, gives you 12 meters. Buying one of these, 80,000 euros, so 2,000 euros more, gives you 12 meters. So this is, uh, I hope this explains what I'm, what I'm talking about when I'm talking about working with well no not not working with price performance ratio um so in essence pretty simple lower it down and let it go off and it will cultivate your field different to the star which we had over there which is also seeding now to this one only cultivates um these three over here um still compromise an average um, price performance ratio. Moving on to the ones with a slightly poorer price performance ratio, we have this one over here, the Lemkin Giant 12, and the name really nails it. It's a giant discal. Um, it has 16 meters working width for 122, no, no 121,000 euros, and it's amazing. If you look at this in your in your catalog in your online brochure, it's only 
uh, you can only see it when it's folded together but unfolded it's amazing how big this thing is but a disc harrow um, yeah is always a little bit more expensive than a cultivator basically because of all the components which are used which which are needed for it so with this one you pay um, basically 7562 euros per meter so it's a rather expensive one moving over to this treffler tg uh, 1615 615 there, there it says it um, very nice color scheme from my point of view this blue with the yellow is really really lo looks very nice um this is a cultivator for um 49,500 euros um 6.2 meters and when you now think about it you hear now 49,500 euros or so less than 50,000 euros we have here a piece of equipment which costs over 120,000 euros this sounds um relatively cheap but in essence unfortunately it's not really um because the um because it only has six meters 6.2 meters of work with you're paying over eight thousand euros per meter and with uh, the lemkin for example which has is 10 meters wider actually you're paying five seven thousand five hundred per meter um so although this looks very nice and it seems to be rather cheap with less than 50,000 euros um, it's actually quite expensive yeah moving on to the last two of the bunch we have this Werderstedt uh, over here it's a Werderstedt carrier XL825 8.3 meters um, for 75,000 euros and this already speeds up to over 9,000 euros per meter working with so rather expensive um, in comparison to other equipment and now moving on to the last of the bunch and here I just want to say I don't want to put down um, the firma Kuhn uh, the company Kuhn firma is German <laughs> company Kuhn um, but I kind of have a problem with the price of this piece of equipment as it's just saying here it's the performer 4000 for meters working with for 69,000 euros if you take for example let's move back here to the cedar that's why I said um, we will go back to this one um, this disc harrow uh, also a Kuhn Disculenta X XM52 um, 6 meters working width plus the seeding function for only 48,000 euros and this one less working with no seeding function and it's 20,000 euros it's 20,000 euros more to buy um, I kind of don't understand it because it's also a discount just like the other one over there but yeah I don't know what they did there um, so in essence yeah unfortunately although it's a nice piece of equipment it's the one with the worst price performance ratio you actually if you recall um, the Vedashet cost 9,000 euros per meter and this one 17,000 euros per meter unfortunately yeah well and basically that's it this is all the equipment um, in farming simulator 19 which you can uh, all cultivators and disc harrows, as I said, power harrows will be covered later on. Um, yeah, that's it for this topic. I hope I, I could help you. Uh, don't forget to like uh, and leave a comment. Um, thank you very much for your interest. Um, thank you much for your attention, and see you next time.